Welcome to another Doctors Express Medical Minute. Hi, I'm Dr. Thomas Brown. Uh, today's Medical Minute is on the difference between pneumonia and bronchitis. So this time of year, unfortunately, we see a lot of both, although much more commonly we'll see bronchitis than pneumonia. Now, bronchitis is caused by a virus. People typically aren't that sick. They just have a nagging cough, which doesn't go away for one to three to even four weeks, depending on their age, whether they have healthy lungs and whether they're a smoker. But they don't usually have fevers and chills, uh, fatigue. Those more severe symptoms, uh, people can have in pneumonia. So if you have pneumonia, generally you feel very ill, you may have a high fever, you may feel like not getting out of bed for a few days. Uh, so pneumonia is a much more serious thing than bronchitis. With pneumonia, you may need to be admitted to the hospital, you may need intravenous antibiotics. With bronchitis, actually, all the studies show quite conclusively that antibiotics are not necessary, nor are they actually even appropriate. We can treat uh, folks with bronchitis with other medications. So in terms of treatment and what we can do for bronchitis, really, again, it's the cough that's uh, bothering people. So we can give, if they're wheezing, for example, we can give steroids like prednisone, we can give cough medicine for the cough, at night, we can give things like Robitussin with codeine so they get a good night's sleep. And getting a few nights of good sleep is really what's needed to get over bronchitis. Um, both bronchitis and pneumonia are contagious. So if you have a loved one in the hospital or wh whose immune system is compromised, they're on chemotherapy, that sort of thing, you want to either stay away from them or use good hygiene, wash your hands a lot, use a, a face mask, uh, uh, that sort of thing, so, so you don't get them sick. Again, a lot of people are confused. They come to the doctor because they're not sure they have pneumonia or bronchitis. Again, with pneumonia, you really feel quite sick. When we see someone in the clinic with possible pneumonia or someone whose fever is high, blood pressure is low, heart rate is fast, we want to get a chest x-ray uh, and or blood work. Now, a chest x-ray and blood work can easily differentiate between bronchitis and pneumonia. Again, with pneumonia, we have to treat very aggressively with antibiotics and potentially even admit to the hospital. In terms of prevention, for older folks or, or people with diabetes and COPD, which is emphysema, there is a vaccine for pneumonia called the Pneumovax, and you can get it every five years. So come to a clinic here or talk to your regular doctor and you can get that if you're at risk for pneumonia. Bronchitis, we don't have a vaccine for. It's caused by a virus, any one of the number of viruses. But this time of year, December, January, February, March, Bronchitis is very common, so you gotta use good hygiene, wash your hands commonly, wear a mask if necessary, all those sort of things. If you're concerned that you have bronchitis or pneumonia, of course, here at Doctors Express, we're happy to see you. One of our providers will take good care of you. This has been a Doctors Express Medical Minute. Doctors Express Urgent Care has locations throughout New Jersey, New York, Connecticut, and Massachusetts. For locations near you, visit doctorsexpress.com.